Hello and welcome to this quiz series, GCSE Maths. Now quizzes are really great way to learn to revise the subjects you are possibly in taught at school at the moment. So I really hope you can enjoy this quiz. Let's think first of all, what is maths? Now maths, well, the most basic sense is all about following the rules. GCSE maths are just so important. In many ways it can be seen as a passport to your future success. You need a good grade in this qualification to access many sixth form and college courses. There's no secret to success. You've got to master the basic skills through practice, practice and, yeah, you've got it, even more practice. Now in this GCSE Maths section, you'll find 60 quizzes that really give you a fantastic head start in moving towards your goal. On the right hand side here, as you can see, what I've done, I've selected five of the quizzes just to have a look at. Let's start, so first of all, looking at circles. So how well do you know your circles? Yep, I know they're round, but can you tell the difference between the radius and the diameter, the circumference and the sector, a tangent and a chord? This quiz will really test your knowledge. See you again on. Decimals. Now we use a decimal point to separate units from parts of a whole. By this we mean tenths, hundredths, thousands, etc. For example, Think about the number 34.27, 34.27, the value of the figure 2 is a tenth, so 0 0.2 is a tenth, the value of the seventh is a hundredth. In this quiz you'll be asked to interpret decimals and what they mean. Oh, good luck with this one. Logic. Now wasn't it Mr. Spock from Star Trek who saw everything in terms of logic? And when you apply logic to a problem, you reach a conclusion drawn from a series of facts without reference to any meaning or context. You just follow the rules. In this quiz you'll be given a series of situations and you'll be expected to apply logic in order to find a solution. Now remember what I just said. Follow the rules. Now don't you just love sequences? You're given a sequence of numbers then you're asked to continue the pattern. One of the past masters of sequences was Fibonacci who wrote a book about sequences over 900 years ago. Now, as you can probably guess, in this quiz you'll be asked to complete particular sequences. Again, all you have to do is apply some logic. So, do your best. My last choice of quizzes to look at is triangles. Now, triangles are simple polygons. That's a two-dimensional flat shape with straight sides. But, can you distinguish your isosceles triangle from your equilateral triangle? Who is this guy Pythagoras? And what's it got to do with triangles? This quiz will really test your knowledge of triangles, so don't be afraid to get stuck in. So those are just five sections of the quizzes available. Let's take a very brief look now at the quiz itself in action. So here we are at the Education Quizzes homepage. Now what we want, we want GCSE Maths, don't we? So click on GCSE here, and click on Maths there, and this should take us, there we go, we're now in the GCSE Maths Revision area. Now if you scroll down, you'll find lots and lots of quizzes to have a go at. Let's look at one of these in detail, shall we? Let's uh, look at mm, circles. Yeah, circles. Okay. Now the quizzes have a number of things in common. and One of those is they're all based on 10 questions. Another thing is you'll be asked a question and then you'll be given a series of four options to choose the answer from. So in this one here, the diagram below, circle A is completely contained within circle B. What can you definitely say about circle A and circle B? Look at these, which of these correct? If you think it's this one here, the circumference of A is greater than that of... I'm not going to answer the question for you. You've got to do it yourself. Have a go. And as you scroll down the page, you will see there are ten questions, all to do with circles and all following the same basic format. Now when you get down to the bottom here, you'll be offered the opportunity to play this quiz again. Or, you can go back to Maths Quiz Home. Let's go there, shall we? Now, the thing I want to point out here is, on the right-hand side here, it says play, 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 and so on. Now, when it says play, these are free quizzes. You don't have to subscribe to play these quizzes. So, I want to have a go at all of these in purple here, and see you get on. Now, if you really like the quizzes, want to play those labeled here preview, you've got to subscribe. 
Now that is very, very easy. So come over here where it says sign up, leave your details, sign up, check with the parents if you need to, and then you'll be able to play all the quizzes. How great is that? So that's the end of this introduction to GCSE Maths Quizzes. Hope you understand more now what it's all about and how to use the quizzes themselves. Now that you've watched this introductory video, and if you've enjoyed it, why not visit our website educationquizzes.com and subscribe to our quizzes. Thanks for watching and listening to this video. Good luck and goodbye for now.